I don't know, now you're gonna be watching my vlogs with a different angle. Do, 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 Cassidy Quinn. Hey guys, it's me, Cassidy Quinn, and welcome to For Real Friday. Apparently, this has become the thing that I do when I say For Real Friday. I'm not that mad about it. Anyway, happy Friday to you! If you don't know, this is the new series I'm doing where every Friday we just sit down, we have a chat. It gets real because this is not edited. We just talk about some kind of topic. Happy, sad, crazy, I don't know. This week, we're gonna talk about nothing to do with the weather. Nothing to do with politics. Nothing to do with sports. There's a lot of things happening in all of those categories in the world right now. But we're gonna talk about... Uh, hmm? We're gonna talk about something different. So, you might look at me and think, oh, Cassidy is confident. Maybe you don't. Maybe you don't think this at all. She, you know, just goes out and she vlogs places and she doesn't ever get nervous. She's on TV, she's on the radio, whatever. Well, here's the thing. I do get nervous and I get awkward and I just wanted to tell you a little bit about that. So, I do carry my little vlogging camera, my Canon G7X. I don't know why I didn't bring it over here as a prop. I carry it with me essentially everywhere I go. The times that I forget to bring it with me or decide, oh, I won't need it today, are the times that I end up needing something to be shot, so I'll shoot it on my phone or something. But, uh, I've been vlogging and making YouTube videos with my own little camera since 2010, I guess, would say the beginning of that was. And so you would think I'd be used to it. You'd think I'd be used to like walking around in public and talking to myself on a camera. And that is true in a lot of cases, but in some cases, not true at all. And recently I have noticed that I have a tendency sometimes to kind of like hide the fact that I'm vlogging. I don't really know why I do that. Because here's the thing, if you know me, you probably know that I vlog or that I take little Snapchats or Facebook or Twitter videos. You know that I talk to myself via a camera or talk to the internet via a camera in a lot of different formats. And so that shouldn't surprise you if I'm like hanging out with you and then just decide to take my camera out and record something, right? But I guess I don't really realize that. Even with my family who knows me better than anyone in the world, uh, recently there have been a couple times where I've kind of like hidden my vlogging. So a couple weekends ago, in last week's vlog that you saw, I was at Mount Hood with a group of friends. Some of the friends I know pretty well, others I didn't know that well. So I felt kind of uncomfortable just like taking out my camera and vlogging like when everyone was cross country skiing and falling down the hill and I can just picture it in my brain and I'm laughing so hard inside right now but you can't see it because I didn't record it because uh, I felt awkward being like, hey, I don't know you guys that well but can I put your embarrassing falls on the internet? I'm sure they would have said yes, no. But even uh, around the people that I knew better on that trip, we were out snowshoeing and I actually didn't, didn't vlog half of our snowshoeing trip. What you guys saw was the second half of the trip when I was finally like, look, I'm gonna pull out my camera and we're just gonna do it. So I ended up kind of walking away from the group and just vlogging by myself off to the side. This feels so awkward to be telling you this. And because it was like they're off having their own fun thing, they're falling down or whatever, and I'm just gonna vlog so I don't have to be in anybody's way, I don't have to draw attention to myself, I don't have to force anyone to be on camera that doesn't want to. And so any time that I ended up like falling behind from the group on accident or being ahead on accident, I would be like, oh, perfect time to pull out my camera and do a little vlogging. And of course people notice like, they could hear me. It's not like I was a mile away. I was 30 feet in front or behind them, and they were like, oh, Cassie's back there making a video again. But again, it doesn't surprise anyone, so I shouldn't feel nervous or awkward about it. And then last weekend, you haven't even seen these parts of my vlog because they're coming out this Sunday. I was up in Seattle with my family. My mom was out of town, but my dad, my brother, my grandma, the dogs were there. And we went to this dog park. Again, you'll see clips from this on Sunday. But, uh... I don't know, for some reason I was like, I don't want to interrupt family time, I don't want to just be like, hey, my grandma's in town, I haven't even spent more than an hour with her, but I'm gonna put my camera out here and put everyone on camera already. So, we were walking around this dog park, and I just started like recording some clips, not of myself, just like of the dogs running around, and then, eventually, I took one of myself, and then my dad, very rightly so, said to me, is that the first thing you have vlogged on this whole outing? Which we'd only been out for like 20 minutes, it wasn't that long. But I was like, yeah, I don't know why, for some reason. 
I just didn't. And so then, you know, the vlogging floodgates, the vlog, vlog gates had been opened and then it was just, you know, everything broke loose and my dad was on camera, my brother, he's still somewhat reluctant to be on camera. Grandma, I don't know if she knows what's going on when I put the camera in her face, uh, but she was on camera, I think willingly. And so then after that, it was like all open. It's just like that first moment of vlogging, you just have to rip off the band-aid and just start vlogging. So I'm not totally sure why I'm telling you guys all of this. Now I'm feeling like you know all of my secrets and I don't know, now you're gonna be watching my vlogs with a different angle, knowing what goes on behind the scenes. Which I think is the point of these For Real Friday videos, just to talk about something real. Whether it's about something going on in the world, or the weather, as seems to be the case lately in Portland. Today was supposed to be the ice apocalypse, but n not a lot happened, which was good, because I'm going out of town tonight. If you're watching this right now, I'm flying to visit some family and I'm very excited about it. I'm glad that my flight isn't getting cancelled. Let me knock on my desk so that, that really doesn't happen. So, I will see you on Sunday for a weekly vlog and let me know in the comments below if you have other topics that you think I should talk about in these For Real Fridays video because I would love to just open up the the vlog gates again with the horrible pun. Is that even a pun? And hear your thoughts. Can't talk. In the comments below, what do you think about feeling awkward? Are there situations you feel awkward in? If you do make videos, are there things that make you feel uncomfortable or moments you just have to like go for it. If you are thinking of starting vlogging and you thought you just would feel too awkward, just know that I still feel awkward years later. So, I don't know if that's good news or bad news. But thank you so much for watching. I will see you on Sunday for a weekly vlog. Click the thumbs up if you ever feel awkward in your life. If you don't, bravo to you. Click that subscribe button also because I didn't hit the cactus again. Five weeks going strong. I will see you on Sunday. Okay, bye!